This week we're here at Letchworth State Park and it's winter times which is a different time to visit the park so we're gonna take a tour and show you around the park. Yep it's a nice uh, sunny Sunday afternoon it's about 45 degrees which isn't too bad. There is uh, snow in the park so we brought the dogs along to do a little bit of hiking. Letchworth State Park was voted the number one state park in the country by readers of USA Today uh, newspaper in 2015 and you can see why when you look behind me. It is also considered locally as the Grand Canyon of the East so it is definitely a place you want to come and visit when you're in this area. Now Letchworth is located about 35 miles south of Rochester, New York. We came in the Mount Morris uh, entrance to the park. It's in Livingston County and the park is 17 miles long. The main road through the park is 17 miles long and it occupies over 14,000 acres of land. There is hiking, biking, uh, rafting, uh, ballooning. You can, you can take a hot air balloon ride, weather permitting, horseback riding. There's plenty of activities to do here while you're staying at Wellesworth. Below me is the Mount Morris Dam and this is the Genesee River and this dam was put in place in 1948 I believe and it is used to control flooding down the Genesee River towards Rochester. So right now you can see the upper part of the river is pretty dry but as all the snowfall melts it will obviously fill in and a quite a bit of water will come down through this river and down into the valley, the Genesee Valley. By the river or the stone So in this area, Ashworth State Park has their annual craft show, which is held yearly on Columbus Day weekend. Um, we've been a couple times. It's really, there's a lot of crafters and food and a lot of people. <laughs> Yeah, this whole this whole section of the park, this one whole uh, picnic area, is actually just full. Uh, there's probably what, 200 uh, crafters here or more. Oh, at least yes. Yeah. And you want to come early because, like we said, it does get very crowded. Right. It's the last uh, camping weekend of the park, so if you want to come and camp, you definitely want to make your reservations early for that. Um, and when coming just into the park. Yeah, you definitely want to get here early because it does line up and, um, you know, fill up pretty quickly. Yeah, but it's a fun event. So this is the Gordon Harvey pool area and it's one of the two swimming areas within the park. There's one here on the east end and there's another one on the west end of the park. This one is very nice. I can remember coming to this one as a kid. This has an Olympic sized pool, high diving boards, everything. It is really a neat swim area. So if you're coming to stay at Lodgeworth and you're here between June and September, this pool area will be open and you can swim in it. This is February, pool's closed. So we have to come back. So we entered the park here at Mount Morris. We came up here and we stopped and looked at the Mount Morris Dam. And then we came over here to the swimming area. You can see here's the Genesee River going through the park. We traveled through the main park road through here to the Perry area. And that's where we exited. Um, down through here is the camping area here. This is High Banks Camping. Um, normally this section of the park would be open during the summer, but during the winter time they don't maintain it. So we re-entered here at Castile and we came, we're now coming over here to the visitor center. Um, this is the Lower Falls area. There's another swing pool. This area is temporarily closed off, um, not just for the winter, but they're also doing some reconstruction. Um, we're going to go in here to the Glen Iris Inn area and the Upper Falls, and we're going to get some really nice views of the Upper Falls area here. The river or the stone Meant to 
stay all meant to go Perhaps a little bit of both Am I the river or the stone? All right, so we've made our way to the upper falls behind us and this is really pretty at this time of year with the snow and the ice around it, isn't it? It's beautiful, yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. a perfect day. Yeah. Am I the fuel or am I the flame? Meant to give or take away. Perhaps I'll always be the same. Am I the fuel or am I the flame? The Glen Iris Inn, and this was uh, William Payne Letchworth's home when he uh, acquired this property at the end of the 1800s. And he, this is where he lived until the day he died. He gifted this property in 1909 to the state of New York to be used as a state park with the provision that he would get to stay here the rest of his life, which only ended up being another year. He passed away in 1910. It wouldn't be 1910. It would be 1910. <laughs> All right, so this is going to include our little tour of Letchworth State Park. We hope you enjoyed it. Did you enjoy it? Yes, it was a very nice day. Um, a lot of people had the same idea that we did. We got to see the upper falls and the middle falls. Unfortunately, the lower falls was closed, so we were unable to go down there. But that's for another visit. But yep. yes, it was a very enjoyable afternoon. Yeah, we'll definitely have to come back here during the summer and you know do a summertime tour of the park and maybe even stay here for the campground for a few nights see yep that would be yeah that would be fun the dogs would enjoy that too yep yeah exactly well we hope you like this video and if you did please give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new here so that you can follow along on our adventures we post new videos every week so hit that notification bell and we'll let you know when we have a new video on the site and until the next time we will see you down the road bye, bye. Am I the river or the stone? Meant to stay or meant to go? Perhaps a little bit of both. Am I the river or the stone?